morning. Oh, you know we're leaving. I'm so happy. Plain vanilla latte. Landed in Charlotte from Milwaukee. Food. I slept the whole way, which is great, but still I'm running on like four total hours of sleep since last night. And next we are leaving from Charlotte to Bermuda. had my first experience where you drive on the left side of the road instead of the right crazy but just got to the hotel we actually weren't originally in this hotel and I'll tell you why but it's just you know we're only here for a night and then we actually go to a different hotel when we walked in the lobby it was seriously just so pretty I tried to take clips of like all of the art it was just like there's beautiful chandeliers like sculptures it was just so beautiful like there's just detail and everything and then we're actually in an ocean facing room isn't that crazy look at this This literally looks fake. It looks fake, it looks fake. It's not fake though. <laughs> Prettiest beach I have ever seen in my entire life. I got in at like four something, so it's already past five, and we want to get to dinner at six. When it opens, in case it's busy, but what I brought for this trip is one liquid IV for every day that I'm here because I drink so much water at home, but when I'm out, like literally anywhere, I do not drink enough water, and I can always feel it. And <laughs> I even brought the immune support ones because it has like extra vitamin C and stuff, and I figured when you're traveling, you could just use help in that department. So I'm gonna have this before I get ready, and then, Sushi time. Sushi on the beach. Oh, oh, say less. I even brought my liquid IV little water bottle because I wanted to take a water bottle on the plane that didn't spill. I'm ready for sushi. I wanted to come out here to show you the outfit though. Can you see? I have this like Skims dupe Amazon bodysuit with my favorite ever trousers from Princess Polly and the cutest little BG sandals. I think this is such a cute look. We got free drink tickets from the hotel for the hotel bar, so we got Prosecco. Basically, we were originally gonna stay at a different hotel, but they canceled on us, and then we got rebooked here, which was such an upgrade, but for no, like, extra cost, which was so great. It is so pretty here, and we are only here for one night because we go to a different hotel tomorrow, but it's been a great night. Big vibe, big vibe. Although I do think the four hours of sleep, um, including plane ride sleeps, is starting to hit, so I don't think we'll be out here very long. It's only like 8.30. Also, sushi was amazing, don't get me wrong, but we spent $20 on water. On water. $20. We didn't realize that opening a second like bottle of water was gonna be we what it was. We didn't think the first bottle would be $10. We would have ordered different water if possible. <laughs> Packed up, we are checking out and heading to the beach until our next adventure of the day. This is where I will be for the next approximately four hours. I'm gonna get some editing done. It's 
it started raining so i actually came inside i'm by myself right now and i just ordered a drink it looks basically like an aperol spritz but like a little different it's very good but so i'm just vibing chilling by myself not on my computer anymore about to have a protein bar i also brought you know i have like green powder every morning i brought capsules and i finally ordered a water so i can take them i was like oh i don't have any water no i can take them but they're in my backpack i'm trying to like keep up with my habits so that i can like feel good and be happy this whole trip you know but so we're getting in our protein <laughs> but i'm by myself vibing so good cookie dough flavored i obviously have no service i didn't like purchase any but i also don't have wi-fi right now so it's just me and my thoughts the next hotel let me show you you walk in over here I'm showing you the bathroom first closet beautiful but look at literal like bathtub and everything it's absolutely gorgeous is this a shot whoa this is the shower that's nuts okay this mirror I want to take it home you know you know what I mean okay um, Literally, look at the china. There's literal like beautiful china in the room. Like what? This is gorgeous. We have like a literal living room and then this bed and it has like curtains on it. Canopy type style thing that's beautiful. And then I thought our last view was good. It's locked. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. Let me just, yeah. Yeah. This is actually insane. I think my tiredness from yesterday is hitting me though, so I am gonna make a coffee. This is an espresso, like how friggin' cool is that? Oh. Oh! It's so hot! This mug is the cutest thing ever. I want this set for my house. I'm not cool enough to be here. I need this so bad. It is 4.30. This is very late afternoon, but uh, I don't know how late I'm gonna be up tonight, and I'm tired, so. This is the, definitely the prettiest place I have ever been to, I swear. I just wish that the camera would show you what it's like in real life, because it just does not do justice, ever. Oh yeah. Currently getting ready for some casual dinner and drinks, and before I do, you know it would be so smart of me, I'm trying to stay on my A game. I'm probably so dehydrated. I have not drank much water today. We're having a liquid IV, another like immune boost one. And also, I mentioned those capsules earlier. We're gonna take some. It's like greens and fiber and stuff, and I'm probably lacking in that department. So this little um, afternoon refresh before a good night and some drinks and stuff is well needed. So it's been a minute. Okay, this lighting's better to talk. So last time I saw you, I was actually getting ready for casual drinks and dinner Thursday night. It is now Saturday morning. I did not film at all yesterday because I actually started the day very hungover. Um, we had a great time Thursday night. It was so much fun, but we did stay up until about four in the morning and I woke up the next day in an interesting state and that's you know what vacations are about. No shame here. No shame here. You know, I I love me a good balance, right? We talk about that all the time. But so we did go into town yesterday, and then we had a dinner last night on the beach. It was beautiful. You know, it's Saturday, the day of the reception. I literally love this place. I cannot believe how beautiful it is. This is by far 100% the most beautiful place I've ever been. I mean, Switzerland was gorgeous but in a whole different way. And I'm actually sad to leave tomorrow, but I'm so excited to see Duncan. We're staying at the Rosewood Hotel. It's very fancy. So in case you are planning a trip and want something luxurious, the Rosewood. <laughs> the outfit. I am obsessed with these little onesie things. This is just from Amazon. 
Converse. Base belt bag. A little beachy button up, you know, to make it feel more Bermuda-esque. Let's have ourselves a day. This walkway every morning, every time we have to go anywhere, it's just so pretty. You have the bluest water you ever did see. We're finally making our way to the pool. We have not been there yet. My swimsuit is praying. <laughs> Isn't it beautiful here? Look at this. Okay, so it's the night of the actual wedding, the reason we're here, and so I just wanna show you my look, and then I'm gonna go have fun. And I'm sorry, but I'm not bringing you with. How cute is this dress? It's from Princess Polly. I think it's so flattering. I love it. Okay, let's go party. <laughs> She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa.